Well, when someone found a necklace containing ashes inside a locket at a park in Woodhaven, we told you the story, hoping that it would help them return it to loved ones, and we're happy to say it worked. As the now Detroit's Kim Russo tells us, today the necklace containing a baby's ashes were returned to her mother. It happened earlier this month. Someone was near a baseball field at Civic Center Park in Woodhaven when they found this necklace with a charm holding someone's ashes. They turned it in at a nearby concession stand. This is somebody's loved one, so, you know, we really wanted to find out who it was. It has to be extremely important to them. Workers at Woodhaven Parks and Rec wrote posts on Facebook hoping social media would help them find the necklace's rightful owner. Seven Action News saw their posts and decided to help. We turned on the news and it was right at the end of the, the newscast. Today, Kalina Sexton picked up the necklace with ashes that belonged to her daughter. That was actually one of the last pictures that was taken of her. Um, that was taken on the Sunday before she passed away. Six month old Skyla Sexton died after family members say a drunk driver slammed into their van in Inkster in March. She says her cousin was wearing the necklace at the park and felt devastated when she realized it was missing. Thank you very much for everybody who posted it. Thank you very much for the people who actually found it and turned it in because it, it is something special. It's a piece of my daughter. Kim Russell. The now Detroit. Wow, is that amazing? A piece of her daughter. I'm so glad we jumped into action and, and got that back that to her. That is the power of social media and TV stories and everything. Absolutely.